Hey, it's Crafty Kitty. I'm here to share with you a Dollarama, a dollar, a U.S. Dollar Tree and a thrift store haul with you. And it's not in any order. I'm just going to try and get this video up and out. But I did find some awesome things at the Dollarama. One second. Got a puppy trying to get up. All right, there you go. Up. Come on. Up, up. Up, up. There we go. <laughs> uh, well, I might as well show you what I got in my hand. This was from a thrift store. It is really cute. It is this Christmas. Uh, it can be a chip and dip bowl or it can be a cake stand. Too cool. I love it. There it is. Chip and dip. Queen. Cake. Ah, oh, I can't even talk. Cake plate. <laughs> so salty. Sweet. <laughs> and I paid uh $2.99 for this. Mind you, as Americans, so probably four bucks. We'll see. Uh that's what I got from that thrift store. I only bought the one thing. So let me see what my is this my Dollar Tree bag from the States? No. Okay. This is things I found at uh, the store. It's called the Dollar Pal. I found these gems. And again, they're resin. I found these ones. And I got two... Uh, wait a minute. Did I get... Yeah. I got these ones. They're small. And I got these pink ones, and they're small. Uh, my daughter bought herself two pairs of socks. Or I should say I bought her two pairs of socks. But she needed them. Don't you know. And I found this cute tissue paper with the spiders on it. It was 50 cents. I bought two of those. And then I found this tissue paper with some nice uh, polka dots. I found these stickers. Really cute butterfly ones. They were a buck. They're not thick by any stretch of the imagination. And I found a different Wizard of Oz stickers. So... They're a little bit different than the other ones. Not quite diff as different, but a little bit. But they're so cute. And it just repeats itself. There's two sheets of each. I did find a couple more books of these ones. Of the ones I got before. So... Those are going out in friend mail. I'm not, I can't say who, but somebody will be getting those. Uh, so that was that dollar store. I went to, I'm just going to show you the thrift store stuff I got from Dollar, or uh, from Value Village today. I got these. And I'll show you what they are. And I got two bags of them. Now, this one said $2.99 when I showed her that it said $1.99. On this one, she said, okay, she can have both for $1.99. So, what they are, are cute little square cupcake cake plate holders. Too cute, hey? I think those are too awesome. They're not chipped. And I only found four of them. So, that was pretty cool. Uh, let's get it. And this one here. So, they are cute. I think they might have been from Michael's from one year. And they were donated, I guess. But, cute, cute, cute. Definitely going to use them, I think, on my Mad Hatter Tea Party Tablescape. Then I went to a different thrift store. And I found this teapot. Shaped like an apple. It cost me two bucks. I have an idea for this particular 
teapot. Uh, again, it is for the Mad Hatter Tea Party. I'm missing something here, and I'm going to go grab it right back. Okay, back. And I think I threw them in here. <laughs> I had them anyway. But I bought this little teapot as well. It was a buck nine or two ninety nine? I thought it was a dollar ninety nine. Oh well, it is what it is. So I get for not paying attention. Um, and I bought this teapot. They both have lids. It's just I think I put the lids somewhere else. So I have this one, which was a buck ninety nine. And what I'm going to do is I have a DIY I'm going to actually do and show you. And it is going to be for the um, Mad Hatter's Tea Party. So basically I'm going to do something and I'll show you. I'll do the video. I won't show you now. Uh, I'll leave that to be a surprise. Put those there. Okay. So the other thing I found at a different thrift store was this whole bag of ribbon. There's a whole whack of it. Purples, pinks, whites. Uh, it was 95 cents. I think that some of it will probably go to friend mail. I also found this whole container. Uh, it does have scrapbook stuff inside. Now, there's a story for this. A uh, bunch of different scrapbook items inside. I'm not going to pull it out because it's like scrapbook paper. And there are some stickers and stuff inside here, which is pretty cool. But the best part was I was looking through this bag because I opened it and I wanted to see what was inside of it. So I was digging through just to see what was inside of it when I after I bought it. And I... I bought it on my lunch hour and then I went back to my office and during my break I thought I'm going to snoop through this thing and see what it is. So I opened it up and I dug through all these things and then I noticed there was an envelope inside this container and I thought, ah, just an envelope. I thought maybe there'd be like stickers and stuff. Nope. I found $10 inside here. Two $5 bills. I was like, wow. <laughs> So I bought, had bought this and that little baggie of, um, of uh, ribbons. And so I paid $3.90 for both. Uh, and then when I got back to my office, I found $10 inside here. So I got it for free. Plus I made six bucks out of the deal. <laughs> so it's a pretty good buy. Uh, when you're buying big bulky barn thingies like this, make sure you dig through them really well because you never know what kind of surprise you're going to end up with. That's for darn sure. So, I, all I can say is, yay! <laughs> um, that's it for all of the, the thrift store items. I'm going to show you the Dollar Tree items I got when I went down to the States. Um, the, the reason I went there was because I watched my friend Lacey from Lacey's Space. Uh, she, had gone, she was showing items she had got from her Dollar Tree. And the first thing I noticed was a uh, pumpkin form wreath and of course I found all the Dollar Trees up here in Canada and nobody had it so I went down across the border and got me see how big this thing is my head like totally I fit two of my heads two head maybe three I can fit three of my head inside here these are huge and so I picked some up and the best part, I picked up a couple more for a friend of mine. And she'll be getting these shortly too. Once I figure out a box that'll fit these things in order to mail them to her. And uh, yeah, I have a couple of DIYs I want to do with these. Um, hopefully I can get those done and in time for fall and whatever else. Because it was a lot of fun. Now, the other thing I got from down there was... I bought two bags of these. Snyder... Um, mini uh pretzel packs these are great these are awesome of course the first bag is already gone and it'll last very long came in the house and what was it but the other thing i found when i was down there and these were the only two that were left was this green velvet one i thought we were going to get these in canada but i didn't see them at all and this teal colored one so 
beautiful. I really, really like the, how these turn out. I did have a bunch of pumpkin forms that I was going to fix up and maybe if I could, you know, dress them up a bit, give them a little bit more style. <laughs> so I got those. Uh, the other thing I got was this cute little sign. It says, bless the family beside us and the love between us. I really like that sign. I thought it was so cute. The other thing I found there were these and their wooden DIY stickers. <laughs> so I'll show you the bag that didn't fall apart. So, and these are all wooden pieces. Some are glitter on them. And I wasn't sure if they were in Canada or not, so I just picked them up when I was down there. And they did have other ones as well, but I just went with these. Oh, sorry. I got two of the green pumpkins. I didn't realize I grabbed three. That's pretty bad. <laughs> and then the other thing I found down there was this little cutie. And the reason I picked her up was because... Come on. Because she's not working. <laughs> What's that, Maya? Hey. Let's make her do it again. Just a minute. <laughs> Maya doesn't like it. All right, we're going to shut her off. Ooh, Maya. Can't have it. <laughs> Look at her. She's like, what, wants to see. What, what is that? Hey? What's that? No, you can't bite my little witch. Get out of here. She doesn't like anything that makes any kind of a squeaky noise or that kind of a laugh. But I bought her because of the laugh because I love that witchy laugh. It's just fantastic. No, Maya. You can't have it. So there's that. Then I have my Dollarama haul that I just did. And I found something awesome at the Dollarama. And I might save it to last just to show you. But I did find these. Sorry, I got the Marvel playing cards. Maya, leave that alone. And I got the DC comic, uh, the DC comics one playing cards. So I got both. And it's so cute. <laughs> you can't have that. Stop it. Just a cleaning rag for my glasses. And I got, I found one more Venom thing for my friend Stacy which I'll be mailing out to you shortly. I did manage to find two more Ragnaroks, which I'll open at the end. I found some new kind of little stickers. So this one looks like you make the faces, I guess. Pretty cool. I, never, I don't know if that was out last year or not, to tell you the truth. What I do know was not there was these. I don't recall seeing these last year. These pretty cool looking bats. So I bought two of them. Love them to pieces. And they got the nice little red eyes. I don't know if you can see that because of the glare or what. But not a bad deal. They were only about 25. Maya, leave the witch alone. <laughs> She's bound and determined to get that witch. Now... Here comes the best thing that I found. I was so happy to find this. It is awesome. In just one second, because I pulled its head off. Not on purpose. <laughs> but this is what I found. Ooh, come on. Here he is. He's a vulture. Isn't he awesome? I don't think his wings move. I think they stay, they're kind of formed next to his body. If they were meant to move, they would, but I guess not. I didn't really care. He's just so cool. Now I had I got the dogs last year and I got the owls the year before, but now I got me a buzzard. Buzzard. Ah. That's crazy. Pretty dangerous looking too. Anyways, this was my piece de la resistance. So I think. If you really want him, you better go get him quickly because I don't know how long he's going to last. Anyways, so that's everything that I had for my haul. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, oh no, what am I doing? I have to open these boxes. My goodness. It's a good thing I looked down. 
<laughs> I was just left without opening these things. So keep your fingers crossed that I get no whammies. None. I'm tired of whammies. <laughs> I have enough whammies. I don't need any more whammies. How many times can I say whammy? Quite a bit. <laughs> Alright, let's open this up. Alrighty, let's see what we get. No whammies! What the hey? <laughs> I don't know. Who is this? This is, I guess she's the, oh wow, I didn't get a whammy. She's the other character, the other Valkyrie. Cool. Okay, no whammy there. Awesome. <laughs> At first I didn't realize that she was a different one. Not bad, not bad. I went to a totally different store, so maybe that's why I got somebody else here. Okay, once again, no whammy. Alrighty. We want... Somebody new. Ugh, oh, good gosh almighty. If I get another Loki, I don't know what I'm going to do. He's annoying. You're annoying, Loki. I got too many of him. Had enough of Loki. Maybe that's why he's called the trickster. Because he just shows up wherever. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm happy with this one. As I drop her on the floor so I can't show her to you. And she's gone underneath the chair. Well, alrighty. We'll say goodbye, and I hope you liked the video. If you do, thumbs up. Don't forget to ring the bell when I for when I have new videos, and let's all get crafty. Bye-bye. Don't forget to watch also, uh, to sign up to join the Mad Hatter Teascape part. Tea, the Mad Hatter Tea Party Tablescape. I got it good there. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.